<laughs> this is Time Stories Revolution. It is the same, um, the same universe as the Time Stories, the classic version, but this is compact. Um, we will be playing the Damien scenario, which is a standalone demo. Um, there's no spoilers, so you cannot buy this scenario in the stores. This is only shown at events, uh, shown as a demo. No spoilers. Um, so everyone at home, you can play along. Uh, as with all Time Stories games, we are playing as time agents, fixing anomalies in time. Uh, we each have a character, and the cool thing about the Revolution games is that your interactions with non-player characters are different depending on which character you are playing. Um, who's everyone playing? I mean, uh, you don't need to read out what they've got yet, but I just want to know the names. of. Uh, I am Jennifer Hurley. Very nice. I've got Anton Carnaby. Ooh. I'm Amy Fox. And I'm Doug Evarg. Evarg? I want to say Evarg. Okay. Well, I mean, you are, Evarg. you are oh, I'm Evarg. It's yeah. your surname. Yeah, yeah. it's a strong family name and I stick by it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so this is a cooperative game. And in each, uh, each scenario that is released within Time Stories Revolution has its own objective, which is revealed when we begin the game. Time Stories Revolution is played in rounds, each with three phases. So number one, the time captain, and we do get to take it in turns to be the time captain, don't worry. <laughs> uh, the time captain decides which location the group is gonna visit. So in this scenario, we have our location up here, um, or our, our general map, and there are five options of places we can visit. So the time captain picks one, and then we go there. Mm. Uh, we do have to pay one Azrak for this, and this is these lovely coins here. Uh, Are you making it rain with your Azrak? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I threw it everywhere. Yeah. Right. <laughs> um, I know, I like the sound it makes. <laughs> oh, really satisfying. Really satisfying. And I feel, I feel very rich right now. Yeah. <laughs> You've only got five. That's a lot for me. <laughs> uh, so this is basically the substance that is used to link agents with our characters or our recept uh, receptacles, they're mm -hmm. called. Um, and uh, it also allows us to talk telepathically to each other. And uh, yeah, so we, whenever we go to a location, we have to spend an Azrak to go there. Um, we then read the uh, panorama and follow the instructions. Uh, the second phase is the discovery phase, and we can perform actions until we leave the location. So you can recon a location by taking a card from the panorama and reading it. Uh, I mentioned we have tele 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 telepathy. <laughs> telepathy. <laughs> we have telepathy linking us, meaning that we read a card in private, and then we relay the information without reading directly from it. Um, I think basically we're simulating the fact that we're all going to go to a different location. Mm. We're going to work out what's going on. Then we're going to group up and be like, hey, gang, what did we all find out? Uh, so that's what it's replicating. <laughs> uh, we can also take actions whenever we choose uh, without a time limit. Actions include following instructions on a card, initiating a test or exploring. We do this all at the same time. Mm -hmm. However, Everyone at home is going to be playing along with one of us. This guy right here. I was waiting for you to that. Oh, I'm not saying yet. No. Oh, what am I pointing at? <laughs> you started pointing, oh, so I was like, oh, okay, we better have then. <laughs> um, so, yep, you're going to be playing along with Chris and this Chris. Uh, so, you will basically be reading all of your cards to Twitch and we'll mm -hmm. be pretending not to listen. Um, if you are not reconning or exploring a location, oh no, my, my teleprompt went away. <laughs> Telepathy. Telepathy. Mom, <laughs> <can do> <laughs> uh, if you are not reconning or exploring, exploring a location, you can stand by in order to support another player in an action, meaning uh, you can basically back them up in a test or you can pass them an item and be like, you got this, mm. you can do this, I've got your back. Uh, Third, we, can, we basically leave our current location, we change the time captain, and we can perform a standard update here. So this is where we basically get back some ASRAC that we spent, but we will always, whenever we do this, lose one permanently. The more ASRAC we permanently lose, or that goes into our mission return, uh, basically the worse we've done. So we get a score at the end of the game. Oh, I want us oh, to yeah. score really well. <laughs> so, so even if we complete it, they can still sort of judge us a bit. Yeah, oh, yeah, I mean, if you spend five or more 
Azraq on like permanently. Yeah. Uh, it it says equals pathetic. So <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure I can handle that right now. <laughs> um, Such bad vibes. <laughs> Finally, in that phase, we can also swap items uh, without any sort of penalty, so we mm. can pass each other items. Mm. We will go through tests, conflicts, being ejected from locations and all of this if and when we get to them. Uh, but first, I think we should each read who our characters are in order to get into the game. Mm -hmm. Antonio. Shall I start? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So I'm Doug Evarg, which I think is what we're going with. Evarg. Um, I saw that Matt Clark has said Evarg is grave backwards. So is that a joke on Doug Grave? Oh my God, have they worked yes. out the game? That's amazing. <laughs> if that's oh, true, wow. honestly, that's wow. amazing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Kudos. Um, yeah. Okay, so uh, on my card it says, Doug was raised by his mother. He lives in the lower class district of the town and has been working hard in some stores to provide for his family. Not long ago, he was the school's bully. Mm. So I'm the tough guy. Oh, which, okay. Obvious. Mm. <laughs> um, not long ago, um, oh sorry, no, Doug terrified his classmates, especially Anton. Oh. And says something oh, that's a little me. bit rude that's you. Is that you? Oh, okay. I bullied you. I know. What else is new? <laughs> <laughs> Not missing a beat. <laughs> um, so following the complaint of Andy, one of his victims, he nearly got expelled. Now he tries to make amends to keep his chances to join the sports team in Harvard. He believes that by, help, oh, by helping to find Damien, he will get Anton and his father, the mayor of Dundalk, on his side. Mm. My father's the mayor? Oh, yeah, oh, you're, you're, going you're connected. Oh, wow. But oh, I've, yeah. I've got to try and make it up to you now. Yeah, you do. A bit harsh. <laughs> Sorry. So I'm Amy Fox. Um, <laughs> Amy's father does not pay attention to her. Oh. Yeah. He's often under bad influence or missing because, ellipsis, he's in jail. But his daughter loves him and often gets him out of trouble. Amy is very smart, resourceful and confident. However, she is one of the worst students at the school. Class bores her to death. Even if she won't ever admit it, Amy secretly loves Anton. Oh. That is why Ooh. she agreed to why help him. Why wouldn't you? <laughs> that is why she agreed to help him find his friend Damien. And I'm, I also have taphophobia. Ooh, I'm probably that... mispronouncing that. But it's fear of being buried alive. Oh. I don't like that it's story there grave, because... Yeah. <laughs> yes. I, f I mean, it's a strange thing to put in, so I kind of feel that at some point we might get buried alive. Yeah. And it better I not be not. me. I guess I, I skipped mine. Uh, so my my fear is, oh my Lord, uh, catagalophobia, which is the fear of ridicule. You're ridiculous. Oh. <laughs> um, <laughs> I just want to say hello to Osborne in the chat who says, telef... Telef... Telephone week of red mine! <laughs> yes, thank you. I couldn't say telepathy. Um, okay, so I'm Anton Carnaby. Um, yes, I know. Please, please, no autographs. Uh, I know you're quite keen on me. Uh, I've got a baseball bat. I'm, I'm just going to remind you, I bullied you. Yeah. Um, That's why so. I got I am the son of the mayor of Dundalk. Uh, oh, and my father is currently campaigning for re-election. This does not prevent Anton from being the school's scapegoat. To defend himself, he always reluctantly tells his father the names of the kids who bully him. I'm snitching on you. That's not cool, man. Not cool. <laughs> Local policemen often pay a visit to his classmates' parents, and this is why Anton has very few friends and was happy to get al uh, to get along with Damien, who had just arrived in Dundalk. Oh, I've lost, I've lost my bestie. That's that You've lost your own leaf. I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I have atichiphobia, ati ati which is a fear of failure. Yeah. I'd also like to point out that in my attributes, I have. Oh. One one strength, one dexterity, but I have three charisma. So I'm not very strong, I'm not very dexterous, but I am extremely confident about that. I don't mind talking. Give <laughs> <laughs> to the gap. Yeah. All right, well, I am Jennifer Hurley. Um, Jennifer is a brilliant student who was voted prom queen at her school two oh. years in a row. Wow. wow. Congrats. I feel I've achieved something I didn't in real life. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> And yet, she's far from being a confident, and she's not very popular because of her father. Oh. Uh, he's notorious for scamming most of the local shopkeepers. Okay. Oh, dear. Uh, <laughs> and the shop uh, shopkeeper's children 
go to school with me. Hooray! Oh, oh, there she you go. did not really bond with Damien, but she gave him her notes to help him catch up with the lessons. Uh, she kind of become fond of him, and that's why she's agreed Anton to find him. Oh. Apparently, I'm a toughie. I've got three in my strength right oh, here. Nice. So, yeah. Uh, fear is teratophobia, the fear of monsters, which I think is actually quite a normal fear to have. That's kind of valid. Yeah. yeah. I'm Don't good with monsters. that. I'm good with that. So it sounds like. None of you care about Damien apart from me, and you're all just yeah. coming along on this journey for your own I'm reasons. Fond yeah. of him. <laughs> He's all right. He's all right. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so, who would like to be the time captain for the first round? Ooh. Well, if I'm not mistaken, we go, we pass it to the left. Yeah. So, just for ease's sake, if you start, I'll, I'll take out first. Yeah. Da, 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 da. So we have the prologue here. We have the prologue. So everyone takes one of these, and we get to read what's going on. Thank you. Uh, okay. Uh, and this one we do read out. This one we do. As without putting a card down, not from memory, but from here on afterwards, we have to do it from memory. Yes. Mm. Use our telepathy. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I got it. Nailed it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, transfer, mission order, find the boy. Dundalk, small town, northeast of the United States, Monday, December 1st, 1958. Oh, 50s. All right, so Damien Hammer, 14 years old, vanished four days ago. Lucy Garner, one of his classmates, reported his disappearance. The young boy arrived in town a few weeks ago. The, the discreet child didn't make any friends, but Anton Carnaby, the mayor's son. Anton managed to gather a small group of children to look for the missing boy. You will embody them. OK. Choose a time, Captain. They stow this prologue and place one of their Azrak on the Main Street location on the map. Then they take the story deck, open the Main Street location, and read card A out aloud. And so the adventure begins. <gasps> Ooh! Ooh! So it sounds like we have to go to Main Street have first. Have to go to Main Street yep. first. OK. <coughs> right, so we, we we've pop an Azrak. This way. Yep. Mm. That's one Azrak onto Main Street, if you please. Ah. Cards are escaping. There you go. There we go. That's better. Do you want me to lay them uh, out for yes, you? Yes, if you don't mind, I'll, I'll get A in my hand. Is that an issue? Oh, Sorry, we've got a message is. popped up on our screen. <laughs> and I just want to bring Abby's attention to it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the battery's going to die on my laptop. Oh! Uh, oh no. Stay tuned, bitch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, that's fine. Our very wonderful, capable vision mixer is going to run out here and <laughs> plug it in for me <laughs> any second now. <laughs> Thank you, Bay. <laughs> Love okay. <laughs> okay, here we go. A binding wind frees your cheeks. Uh, hanging on tightly to your bicycles, you're cycling up Main Street of Dundalk. Each agent secretly reads the snap recall card on their receptacle. That's the card with the little lightning bolt on the bottom. Amazing. Mm, that's interesting. Um, okay, and then I get to read something out loud afterwards. Okay, so Chris, you are going to read yours out loud for okay, cool. everyone watching at home, course, yeah. but we're not going to pay attention. Okay. Yeah, don't, because this I'm is really listening. juicy. Okay, guys at home. The missing father. Damien is not the only one who has been missing. Amy's father vanished last Thursday. He's not father of the year, but Amy loves him and will do anything to help him. Do I read all of it in the bottom bit? They can't hear me. Yes. <laughs> Find Amy's father. I think this is perhaps our objective, I think. Find Amy's father, free and safe, free and safe and sound. If you succeed, take two vortex from the Sorry, take two tokens from the vortex without exceeding your starting level. So our starting level to which, and guys at home, we can have four. And so at any point, that's right, I've finished now, guys. You're good. <laughs> You're good. At any point, even if we take it back from the um, from the vortex, we can only ever have four. My elbow just clicked. That's strange. Cool. <laughs> that's good. Okay. Also, just for awesomeness' sake, we've got a baseball bat. Huh. That's pretty cool. Uh, you can't know that. Oh. oh. No, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I feel like I'd see it. <laughs> well, well, yeah. Yeah. It's in, it's, I mean, she's it's just in that literally little basket on my bike. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly it. Okay. 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 Right. So, you you examine the streets on the left. Right the way over there. Uh, a car is parked along the sidewalk. Mm -hmm. A small uh, notice is plastered over a streetlight. A hobo is begging with his dog in front of the restaurant. And a young newspaper seller is shouting the news of today's edition. Ooh. What about it? So, we all get to pick a one of these to investigate. Cool. 
four. And do we go in any order? Um, we kind of all do it at once. Um, oh, what, you mean pick? <laughs> do, we, do we pick in order? I think, well, we, we basically can discuss mm. um, because I think uh, each of our characters does interact with mm. other people differently. Yeah. So we can kind of decide who we think is best to, I assume maybe we have to go talk to this person. Um, yeah. I actually so, have today's newspaper, so maybe it's worth me talking to them. Also, you're yeah. the also got the gift of the gab. Maybe, so it's, yeah. I reckon, yeah. If if if, if cause, yeah, this is a cooperative game, so absolutely mm. we should talk about this. Yes. Um, I think you're the most skilled at speech. If Thank I'm, you very much. Yeah. 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 I so feel like you probably take E. I think it's a fair yeah. gambit. Uh, I just want to say a quick shout out to Hello the Living Ted. Um, <laughs> They're asking, is this a travel game? Yes, this is Time Stories Revolution. Uh, is it replayable? Um, this scenario is only a demo, demo version, so there are absolutely <coughs> zero spoilers in this stream for the main versions that you can buy. Um, so you, you won't have any spoilers, so don't even worry about it. Um, yeah, that's all I wanted to say. It's all good. <laughs> What was happening on Main Street B? Which uh, is this one this on the one far left? On B, there is, there's, there is a parked car there. Mm. I'm Obviously, thinking... Mr Lockpick down there yeah. might, mm. might be in with a, in with a child. I think, so. I think I'd be pretty good yeah, at places, breaking into good. a car. I feel like we should have got you a comb just so you could oh, go like this yes. every time. I need a prop for this game. <laughs> I've actually got one in my bag, but you can't go off stream. Oh! Wait, tell me this now! <laughs> this is amazing! Um, the only... Sure, do you, that makes sense if it's a yeah. locked car. If this is going to incorporate that moving car, I'm very dexterous, so I can jump out of the way well, of that. According, or according, backflip according over. According to the uh, <laughs> whatever's what's needed. What? It's Quit. the the car on uh, panel panel B. Panel B, yeah, yeah. Uh, small notice B. on uh -huh. the street lights. Uh, oh, the hobo that's, that's, and the newspaper seller are the yeah. things we're, we're looking to. The small notes yeah. on this one. Okay, so. Do we, we, a mild theory. Okay, so there's obviously a homeless person yes. on the third card. Maybe you shouldn't go and talk to him because I'm maybe hated your father, by a lot of shopkeepers. Yeah, yeah your father this might have conned him out of living. Good idea. Maybe maybe I'll go and visit a streetlight and not do a lot. Well, yeah. I don't mind. Maybe I should go because I've got I can talk to people. I've got I'm very charismatic. Yeah. Maybe I should go talk to the hobo. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. And I've already got the so, newspaper. I don't need true. another newspaper. So we're going B yes, for I'll take D. Doug. You're taking C. I'll take C. And I'll take E. Um, these ones we read to ourselves. We now, do. Am I going to read this out for for Twitch and the people at home? Yes. Yeah? OK, club your ears, everyone. Mm. Oh, my God, that's terrifying. <laughs> OK, I don't know if I can get... You can a, show everyone a, on yeah, the overhead the camera. Down <laughs> and I zoom in on that. That is haunting. I'm just going to cover that from these treacherous folk at the table. Mm. Possibly get a zoom in on that. That'd I love how it's a cooperative game and we're treacherous. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love them, really. So, the newspaper seller turns into a... Ears, people. Ears. Uh, um, uh. Okay. The newspaper seller turns into a terrifying and armed clown. That's, that's horrible. <laughs> what the hell? Cool. Okay, you can uncover your ears now. Okay. okay. I'm... Uh, I need to take I'm going to need the item deck after you. Ooh. So. Exactly, as you do. We can talk now. I've put my card back, um, but we can talk about what we're doing. Mm, um, okay. Basically, the, the homeless man uh, asked me for a dollar, um, and I'm not mean, so I gave, I've given him a dollar, a dollar. So now I get to take an item. Ooh. Mm. Four. OK. Do you need an item deck? Uh, no, I don't. Okay. No. Where was it? Were you keeping the item deck here? Was it? Was it here? I think it was there. So, and there's something pretty creepy happens at the end here. And so I spoke to this kid, going to read all about it, and he turned into a murderous clown with a knife. As you do. Glad I didn't go there. I don't like monsters. So. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Huh. I, I, I didn't have any premonition on this game, and I, I kind of now know the level we're at. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Stay clear All right. of newspapers. <laughs> <laughs> um, huh. 
All right, I get to take a token, gang. Ooh. So the hexagonal tokens, so we get a punch board, we should explain to everyone at home. We do get a punch board, um, and we can only punch these things once we are instructed to. Um, and the hexagonal ones are group tokens. There we are. So... Uh, living turd, okay. yes, yes, exactly that. Yeah, yeah. <gasps> hey, Georgie. Interesting. <laughs> okay, so... I think I show this to everyone because this is a group token. Mm -hmm. um, I have basically spoken to the homeless man mm -hmm. um, and he said that there was a kid that ran out into the road and caused a crash. Mm -hmm. um, the kid didn't seem to care, pretty sure the kid was laughing and he just ran across into the forest. Um, so that's mildly creepy. Mildly mm -hmm. creepy, but we do know that Damien was here. Oh. He caused the crash caused here. The crash. There we go. Was here. Was here. 1958. <laughs> Blood. Um, okay. Do I read out my item card? Uh, no. Well, it depends what colour it is, doesn't it? It does, um, yes. Yellow. Let's have a little double check. I think the green... The yellow ones are... Yellow ones are peak. personal challenges. Yes. Oh, I don't want to deal with this. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but that's a personal with, event. Yeah. Yes. So for the guys at home, I have to read it out. Yeah. You do. So, uh, as we know, there was this terrifying newspaper clown. So the terrifying clown suddenly changes into the newspaper seller. You recognise Philip, a boy from school. Philip! <laughs> I should I be totally here. <laughs> Damien, I'm glad he's gone. Never trusted this guy. I don't like that. To talk with him, read your interaction card two. I'm assuming that's my interaction card. No, 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 interaction card two. Yep. So, whenever it actually... Sit, oh, I've finished. Oh, you're done? Yeah, okay, <laughs> no, I was explaining the interaction cards. Okay. So you've got a deck of cards here, one to seven, and sometimes it instructs you on the card. Everything's really, everything you need is actually on the cards, which is brilliant. Mm. So there's not too much you have to sort of check back with anyway. Yes. Um, but yeah, I've been told to talk to the boy with the newspaper who turns into a clown <laughs> to use my interaction card two. So I just want to give oh, a quick shout out to Agent Dave Seven, who is wondering who the unidentified individual is. Uh, you must have missed the beginning of the stream. This is Chris. Another hey! one. New friend. <laughs> another Chris. Um, if Double it gets fun. confusing, we're thinking of nicknames. Um, haven't well, haven't worked that out yet, but you know. Yeah, we'll anyway. see. Uh, I need to read this out. Do you want to? I think this is. Oh yes, this is for you and the this chat. Is for guys at so. Home? <laughs> so. This is us talking to the clown slash newspaper boy, you know, his alter ego. Hey, Amy, you came at the right time. I want to stay cool, but your father took advantage of all the fuss about the car accident Damien caused the other day, and he snatched one of my newspapers. I don't want any trouble, but I need to get paid for it. Wow, rude. Uh, take token M, then take token K, and place it on your snap recall card. Your father was on Main Street that day. Pop that in chat, someone, just so you remember. Father was on Main Street that day. I don't know if it's important, but let's keep notes. Um, so I need token M. Well, I already have that, so you don't need to grab right. another one. And token K. Oh, this Ooh. is a personal one. Down straight. This is your item. Ooh. Well done, guys. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's just a picture of the newspaper boy again. Stop haunting me! <laughs> I love that you were just like, you turned into a monster. Say cheese! <laughs> I believe I now, after an interaction card, I actually discard that, don't I? Or does it go back in my deck? It doesn't, it shouldn't come back. You. Yeah. yeah I've spoken to him. You so could probably keep it in use. the pile. Yeah. yeah, it's probably not going to come back. I'll just keep it in order, just for sake. Yeah. I've still got my, my location card. Mm -hmm. uh, so, just to let you guys know, um, the car's empty. Oh, OK. But there is a newspaper and some documents inside. So maybe I could try and lockpick it, because, you know, I'm cool and I'm good at that. I've already got a newspaper. Maybe you want another one. I mean, my newspaper doesn't actually really say anything. I don't, oh, this is about an accident on Main Street. Yeah. Mm. Meh. Do you lose this after you use it? No. I think I... Oh, then go for you it. Keep that. Keep yeah, that. you do it. Yeah? Yeah. So I'm going to do a test, basically. Good. Okay. okay. Um, can I explain sort of the numbers and things? Or Yeah. Yeah, so uh, for my one, it is a dexterity test, which makes sense for mm -hmm. lockpicking. Um, and it's a level four one. 
So I think that's quite high. It is. I can tell. So on our character cards, we each have a, a strength, a charisma, and a dexterity, um, and we've got a little number. How, what is your dexterity? My dexterity is three, but it's also plus one bonus if I have the lock picking set. Okay. Yeah. Which you do? I do. So awesome. However, <laughs> what also happens is, let's say Tony doesn't go for any, any bonuses, because what you can do is spend one of your tokens to increase your score. So at the moment, what Tony needs to get is a number... Well, she needs to reach number four. Mm. However, at the end, when you've kind of gone, right, I'm ready to go for the challenge, you also have to draw a destiny card, which could be minus two, or it could be plus two. Mm -hmm. It always says on the top here how many is... Uh, how many... How many cards are in the deck? Yeah, thank what you. The worst Drawing result you could possibly get is, and what the best result you could There we possibly. go. Ah, OK. So it's going to be something that's going to change your score. So mm -hmm. Antonio now could try and add to the score to make sure nothing bad happens. Mm -hmm. Or you could push your luck. Well, I think I've... I've got it bang on at the moment mm. if I mm. use my lockpick. And you do actually have to pay an Azrak anyway to do mm. the test. So pay that into the vortex here. Oh, into the vortex. Up here. And then I think I've completed it. Uh, no, you've got to try another destiny. Ah, OK. So but before do you we do. think this is going to be a positive or a negative modifier on this card? I'm feeling pretty negative. Do we, do we want to <laughs> help? Do we no, I've actually not up? got anything in front of me, so I can use an action, if I'm correct here, to mm. support my fellow... Yes, receptor. that that will yes. cost you another Azrak, though. It will. However, I am feeling pretty negative about this. I've just got a hunch that it's going to be bad. So I'm thinking I might give you a hand here. Unless and, you want to okay. spend more, because you've actually got... You start off with more than I do. That's true. And how important do you think the breaking into this car is? Like, That's how much do we need these papers? We don't yeah. need the paper at all. We've got the paper. We don't need the newspaper, but, but there, there are, are documents. other documents. There are documents. I very much doubt if that's the one that hit Damien. He went, I hit Damien today. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> Dear diary. <laughs> Day 32. It's not going well. You are the person that is most likely to lockpick, and you're already in the motions of doing it, so yeah. we may as well try and succeed yeah. this. Yeah. Um, I have more Azrak than the two of you, and... This is true. I have no location in front of me, so I could back you up if... You could if you wanted to. back up? Yay. I feel like this is quite early on in the game. I I'm good at this. I feel like I'm just breaking into a car. It should be okay. Okay. <laughs> it's your Famous call. Last words. Yeah. <laughs> you know how to I break into cars. This. <laughs> I mean, don't look at me. I'm the mayor's son. I never get in trouble. If you know how to break into cars, then. <laughs> mayor's son. Sorry. Um, mayor's son supporting somebody in my to break into a car. <laughs> don't read Twitch, everyone. Uh, yes, Cub, I like that idea. That's an interesting angle. Interesting. Mm, nice. Telepathy. You doing it? I think I'll, I'll do it. So I just draw my destiny card. Draw your destiny card. Okay. Spend, spend one as <laughs> first, which is over here. Yep, Perfect. that's in the, in the vo vortex. Vortex. Is anyone boosting? Nope. No. no. Antonia's no. confident that she's got this by herself. I really regret she's re this already. <laughs> oh. She's rejected all, her, uh, all help. So can I get a drum roll, please? I'm going to flip it. OK, it's good. No! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> no! So that is the minus two. Uh, <laughs> and so Antonia's possible dead. result. Um, <laughs> I died from breaking into a car. Two <laughs> exploding cars. Someone <laughs> called it. Um, so there are three different options on yeah. your test that you took. There's a minus, there's a plus, and there's an equals. The equals is oh. always the best yes. result. That's um, not bad. So you have to read the minus one, and that's what affects us. So my minus is you can give it another try. OK, I think they've gone easy on you today. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, this is the first round. I think yeah. um, they, they're going... Do you think we have to pay the Azrak for the for, second try? You do have to pay the Azrak to mm. the end. Uh, OK, cool. You'd have to pay. Yeah. What do you guys but think? I, Are we I think allowed to see this card no. that she's got in her hand? No, but okay, we're allowed so I shouldn't have seen we're that, but there's something interesting on there, which talking. is a symbol. Which you weren't meant to see. It was not as meant to see, no, but... <laughs> We're using our telepathy. Yeah. I actually, because it's the 50s, I prefer the idea of us having walkie-talkies. <laughs> yes! <laughs> but I think it's kind of one of those things where we've gone into a machine which has taken us back in time. Yeah. But I still but want us to have walkie-talkies. <laughs> okay. Let me have walkie-talkies! <laughs> <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, I, 
I personally feel like it's going to cost us a lot of ASRAC permanently yeah. to come back to a location, so yeah. maybe we should just do it while we're here. It cannot be worse. worse that could happen. It can't be worse than minus two. Yeah, you've said the words. <laughs> So are they all minus two? Yep, yeah, they're all minus two, never mind. Oh, no, sorry, they're all minus two or plus two. There's nothing yeah. in between on this uh, no, there, are, oh, no. there are in-betweens, you just oh. don't know what they are. It's just okay. telling you what the worst result you could possibly get is and the best result. So, in theory, there could be five minus twos and one plus two. But yeah, we but don't I'm saying there's, no, there's not really any minus one, zero, plus there ones. There might be. There might be zeros oh. in there, could be minus ones, don't plus I? ones, but we know at least there's one minus two and one plus two. Oh, I'm following you. Right, OK. I thought that was the only two options, was either a minus two or a minus a plus two. Why am I getting that wrong? There's a, a mix. Uh, Mummy Games Meister would like you to try again. So go again. Yes, OK. Right, so Let's you pay your Azrak into the middle. OK. This is expensive. <laughs> so basically, there sound, was somebody though. who just walked along the street, and I kind of thought, oh, OK, can't, can't have a go. Innocent. Going to go again. Yeah. OK. Ooh, would you like backup question. this time? Agent Dave says, can chat do rerolls in a situation? Oh. Let, let's, I'm going to give the rule Ooh. to you guys, if that's OK. And um, let's just talk about the rule. If you spend your meeples on a reroll, will it cost as a token? So you guys can possibly help us out. Is that a fair gambit? And yeah, like, I mean, that's not how you would play the game the rules, normally. But, but obviously, if we were well, trying to get you guys involved as well, yeah, if someone I wants to spend can. their meeples, perhaps we can get a free... A freebie. And it's only our first is test, and we did so terribly yeah. bad at it. You don't have to use it right now, though. Let's maybe save that until we're all dead. <laughs> <laughs> but good thinking, good thinking. But yeah, that okay. wouldn't happen normally, but obviously we're trying to get you guys involved. Yeah. So, so does anyone want to back me up? No. Yes, yeah. why not? <laughs> have an extra plus one to your skill. OK, so we're at five now. Yeah. Mm. I think, thinking? no, I think that's enough. I think yeah, it's enough. Good. It's going to be a plus two, I know. Yeah. Plus one! Yay! Okay, so... You've got six. Yes. So that means... Um, Sorry. I, <laughs> I take the paper, which is item ten. Okay. Oh. Uh, this one. Here you go. Here you go. Or the newspaper. Oh. oh. Which is on my interaction card seven. Or oh, which one would you want? Oh. Take the item. I think... Oh. And take the paper or the newspaper. I think we probably want the paper, right? We've already got a newspaper. Yeah. I mean... So not this one, you need that then. I've already got today's newspaper. No, that one. Yeah. OK, that one. No, no, I need interaction. Oh. No, sorry, yes, no, that one. <laughs> that one, there we go, we got it. <laughs> OK. Struggling with reading the cards, guys. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Oh. I do keep this one, don't I? I think so. I mean, the, the, uh, the personal one. Oh, no, I think... Um... Is that going to go into discard pile? Once they Once are Once they're done, resolved, they, they go back. To... It's like a discard pile. Yes. Yeah, Basically, you're enough. not going to need that. I have a Let's keep our space one, free, but I'll, uh, I'll keep my I have token. a green one, so this stays with me. Oh! Mm. Um, the notice I took down from the lamppost mm -hmm. uh, tells us what day Damien's gone missing. Mm -hmm. Ah, OK, cool. What he was wearing. Nice. And his potential last known whereabouts. Interesting. Oh! So, yeah. That's, that's quite helpful. that's here is yeah. a little bit... <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you know the whereabouts? Uh, what it was wearing? No, um, but, but uh, if, I have, if we have any information, I can, we can call a certain telephone number to so hand it over. OK. You're going to call, aren't you? I, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Taking everything in my willpower. <laughs> mm -hmm. Who are you going to call? <laughs> um, do, 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 do. It just says, if you have any information, do, 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 phone this do, do, number. Do, do, do. Um, but yeah, he was wearing a uh, blue jacket and brown trousers. OK, right. so right, if you cool. find a telephone, maybe uh, you should go to the telephone. Yeah, possibly. OK. Possibly. I nice. also got an item, mm -hmm. uh, which is actually a medical prescription, uh, which was given by uh, Dr. Stephen King, I think. <laughs> 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 which I love. Um, can't really make out who it was for. It looks like it might be John G. Chambers. It's a bit smudged, so I can't really tell. Oh, OK. Um, got their address, which is... Am I allowed to read this off? Or am I sort of... Your uh, telepathy, you're not meant to read directly yeah. from it, but you can... OK, I can summarise. <laughs> so she so reads from it. I'm just going to read from it. Um, so the medical prescription, it's for sleeping pills for a John C. Chambers. Interesting. Okay, so, so don't know how that no, comes thing, into it yet. Well, no, no, because maybe he took some sleeping pills while he was driving. 
big no-no. Yeah. And that made him crash. Well, the, no, it was Damien running out into the road that made them crash. Well, that also helped. We don't actually know that it's actually these, that car that was involved in it. It's just that's a car yeah. that's parked outside. It'd be pretty strange to just park it where it was hit. It's outside a liquor store. It is, isn't it? It is, yeah. <laughs> so amidst all of this, we know that someone's got some insomnia. <laughs> Wasn't uh, worth breaking into the that's car. That's really not worth it. <laughs> all right. Okay. Does anyone else want to do anything else from this location? I think it's I'm good. good. Yeah. It's not, it's not worth, do you reckon, anyone else trying anything for you going to another one of them or myself going to another one? No. I feel like I've resolved. I feel yeah. good. I feel okay. like I know Damien was here. Yeah. I feel the like I've resolved post it. The is complete. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Let's do this. OK. So we're moving away. Woo! OK. From Main Street. From Main Street. There we go. So we'll pop that back over here. Should we pop it to the side? I feel like it's going to be one of those. Um, we'll go back to Main Street. We can mm -hmm. do. Was well, this all making sense? <laughs> <laughs> do we want to? Um... You are now time captain. Oh, I am. Yes. Ooh. I'm the captain now. Captain. Uh, now. <laughs> so, do we want to get our Azrak back from the vortex? I feel like at this point we don't need to. However, if we don't do it now, we can't do it later. Is that not right? We can. Do it every time we are done in a location. But it costs, but it costs us permanently. Of yeah. course, yeah. So that was cut, so I was moment. thinking, surely we're going to run out of time. No. But I'll see if we, yeah, if if we leave it for now. Yeah. As you're at saying, the, at we the can... moment we've got three Azarak floating around the vortex. Yeah. Mm. We have to pay one of those into the mission return. That means we're only going to get two of these back at the moment. Not worth it. No. Not worth Let's it. Let's leave it. Let's leave it. Not worth it. See, this is why you're captain. Yep. Yeah. And well, not you because know, it was Chris just in sequence. captain at that point. <laughs> <laughs> you're also captain. <laughs> um, so, the options we've got, we can go to the police station, we can go to Serendipity's Diner, um, Lafayette School, or we can go to the General Store. Um, it's probably a good chance Lafayette School is where we all go. Yeah. Yeah. It, but, yeah. Did anyone get any clues that would send us in a particular direction? Maybe we should no. go to the store. No. Oh, maybe there's going to be a phone at the police station. Do you want to go to the police right this early on? Or maybe not. Mm. OK, let's hey guys, dynamite. We're doing things one. you can't. So it <laughs> seems a little insultive. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I guess it might be. <laughs> All right, let's go to the school. Let's okay. go to the school. I want to go, go to the school. school. So, oh, that is the next one. Handy. Uh, so we've got B, C. Oh, there's a yellow jacket hanging up. It's not. <laughs> there is a theme. <laughs> you did see a clown. Not liking this. Okay. I'm not going to this one, by the way. Someone else can go there. Are you traumatized? Yeah. <laughs> you know the school by heart. On the left, the lockers. Oh, by the way, no one wanted to change, like, swap items or anything, no. did they? No, we were good. What I do really like is it says, you know the school off by heart. But this is what it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> but just in case you forgot them. Uh, on the left, the lockers. One of them is Damien's. The staff room, closed. Uh, Mr. Gaunt's class must have begun in the classroom by now. You can still smell his morning coffee in the hallway. Um, how mm. strong is this man's coffee? Yeah, that must be really <laughs> strong. Uh, Lucy Garner hangs around. She's been acting strangely since Damien Lucy. disappeared. Mm. Who heard about Lucy? Someone heard about Lucy. Did I hear about um, Lucy? I think it was in the prologue. It just sort of said that she reported him oh, missing. Oh, she reported him uh, missing. Yes, yeah. yeah. Okay, so... I knew. Damien I think you best. should go there, yeah, and look through his locker. Maybe I know his locker code, but you can pick locks. Yeah, I mean, I've had some practice now, so. <laughs> might get better. Is that police tape over the over the locker? I think it might be. Yeah, small, oh, wow. it says something evidence, small evidence, but it's probably not small. Oh, sealed evidence. Sealed evidence. Yeah. Do not remove. Oh. I'm going to be the bad boy of the class. I'm going to go there. Uh, what we was said about C? Uh, that that was... Are we allowed to read that again? Yes. Yeah. Cool. Uh, so the staff room is closed. So maybe you need somebody I've to break bat. into it. Mm, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> uh, then we've got Mr Gaunt's class. Uh, I'm a brilliant student, apparently. Um, I am not. So That's... maybe maybe heading to see old Mr Gaunt's with yeah. his coffee breath might be an and idea. I've got a baseball bat, so... <laughs> <laughs> Tell me everything you know! <laughs> OK. I know you reported it missing. You know something the rest of us don't. OK. They'll never Here know. Here we go. <laughs> it's so <sighs> Hello. 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 Hello
Hello to James Barnes of Derby, who's just joined us in the chat. Hello, we're playing Hello. Time Stories Revolution. Uh, yeah. We're all looking for a person called Damien. He's gone missing. Um, so we... The devil's son, isn't he? <laughs> it's not... Something like that. <laughs> So we, we're basically reconning locations at the moment. We've all gone to a different location to have a little fo uh, look for what we can find. Um, but everyone at home is playing along with Chris here. So he reads his out loud and we all pretend that we can't hear. <laughs> I actually can't if I really, really, really yeah. push on my ears. If, if I whisper like this, is that, um, I don't know if you can hear me, but it uh, sounds like that <laughs> ASMR thing. Like, yeah, uh, it might be. <laughs> Hello and welcome to Primetime with Chris. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> anywho, so uh, we're speaking to Lucy, who in the prologue, anyone who's just joined us in the prologue, Lucy was actually the one who reported Damien missing. So I've gone over with my baseball bat and uh, going to knock the seven bells out of her, Ooh. apparently. There she is. That's Amy. <laughs> and uh, that's Lucy, if that helps. Um, so Lucy is. Is. A, a girl? No, but you're close oh, to ears. Is. <laughs> I thought you kept saying Cheating. Lucy is. <laughs> I was thinking, is. I don't know. <laughs> so, uh, Lucy says, the guy who disappeared, I saw him on Thursday morning laughing in, front of the, laughing in front of the school just before eight. I didn't see him in class, so I told Gaunt he was skipping. I shouldn't have. Interesting. Who's Gaunt, though? Oh, the teacher is Gaunt. Th this locker needs lock picking, and I am terribly undexterous. <laughs> so I'm. I know it's going to cost you an Azrak to go yeah. here and to do the test, but I really think it ought to be you, and then I'm going to come and back you up. Okay, cool. I like that thinking. I'm in trouble. <laughs> oh no! I got rumbled by the teacher for <gasps> opening the door, and they want to know now why I was late. So I have a yellow test here. Oh. Um, got a baseball bat. I can't <laughs> borrow that. Let's <laughs> talk my way out of a situation. It may help. Um, so, um, yeah, this is fun. Uh, apparently, if I fail this, I become locked. Locked? Mm. What do they... It means you can't help with group activities. Oh. I'm stuck in class. I believe. Yeah. I, I think that's right. No, that that um, makes sense, I thought. But, it like, says here, actually. Is it like in. M Matilda, where they put you in, what is it, the, you know, the closet? Yes, that's With what I was thinking at first. He is incredibly creepy. Look at this guy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just play, oh. Well, don't, don't fail. No. Good luck. No, I'm trying not to. <laughs> I can't no talk myself out of situations either, so I've got to spend the one yeah, okay. in order to start the test. If I fail this, I'm going to lose this and become... Thrown out of the thrown location. Thrown out of the location quite aggressively anyway, well, so... Well, you have oh, options. Geez. yeah, yeah. If you, so basically, when we get down to zero, or when one person gets down to zero Azrak, they have a choice. They can either take all the Azrak from the vortex, um, but mm. that does mean that no one else, no one else is going to get any. Mm. Um, or you get permanently thrown out the location and you join back into the game once next we location. move on to the next However, location. However, Chris has spent... I boost myself. That's the problem. Oh. Yeah. yeah. But you actually... Truth be told, you you have spent the most out of all of us so far. Yes, you did one here, but yeah. then pretty much two are yours, but then yeah. the other two are yours anyway. Yeah. Can You're I... still fine. Yeah. Can so, I back you up in a personal test? Uh, as long as you no, no longer have a panorama piece in front of you, yeah. yes, I'm, you can attribute, you can add I'm here. Two. I've got you, buddy. Okay, so oh. I'm on vocab two. Hooray! Yeah. <laughs> You're telling him what to say telepathically. Yeah. Fingers crossed. Uh, Destiny cards. Pray for the plus two. Oh, Wait, can I back oh. you twice? Yeah. Uh, I can't wait. Let's have a little check of the that. rules. A quick look. Does it, does it not say on the quick reference sheet? Oh, it may do. Because I'm thinking, I have lots of Azrak and I've not yeah, done anything. That's true. So maybe um, maybe I can back you twice. One tick. Hang on, it is. No, it's just but then maybe I'll run out of Azrak. Yeah. Why do you get kicked it, out of the location? Oh, it's such a re it's resource. Mm. It's really difficult to get support. <laughs> you know when we were like, yeah, yeah we don't need... Yeah, the car, it's all right. I regret everything. <laughs> you can only support once. I can only support once. Yeah. You can spend as many as you want, but to support only once. It's risky. So it's not worth it. I've got, to, I've got to pray for that plus two now in that Destiny draw. Um, okay. Would you mind? Oh! oh. So... I am locked in place and I lose a 
toy at my no! pieces. So Jennifer! <laughs> I am ejected from the simulation for a short length of time. Please nobody else do that. That ends the game now. <laughs> and starting again would be rubbish. <laughs> um just a quick few shout outs. Thank you to living, uh, the Living Ted. Oh, you've just gone past my feed, but I think you just subscribed, so thank you very much. Oh, thank you. And um, someone said, uh, I've, I've, uh, James Darby, James Barnes of Darby said, if there's a butler, he probably did it. Or the janitor who's there. So yeah. mm. I'm thinking Damien's in the bin. <laughs> Uh, James Barnes of Derby would also like to know what is Azrak and why is it in the vortex? So Azrak is the mystical substance that us like time travellers uh, use to basically go back in time and sort out anom anomalies. Yep. Um, <clears throat> it is the thing that allows us to connect with a receptacle, which is our characters. So we're not actually, I'm not actually Anton. I am Abby, Abby a 28-year-old woman pretending to be Anton via Azrak. Because um, that's not weird at all. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that's what basically we have to spend more Azrak to move around. We can get it back, uh, but only at the end of each round. There we go. I think Matt Clark's got it there. Azrak has oh, there a chemical in their blood, which helps time travel. Ooh. Yeah. I think we found our scientist to help us in the yeah, future. Thank yeah, thank you. <laughs> Um, so you're, you're, you're not going to take all the Azrak back, you're going to get I am out going of the to get kicked out of the location and okay. wait patiently in the void. Fair enough. And you went here? Uh, yes, yes I did. Okay. Well, I'm quite... Yeah, you should go there. I'm quite charismatic, so I'm going to go there. What you do mm. might be worth resolving these two. As we're, as we're not doing everything as sort of like a free-for-all, mm. and we seem to be going pretty sort of like, right, I'll take my turn. Because mm. there's no turns, it's just all at the same time mm. if you want it to be. Or you can make it turn-based. But because there's no one to help you, because mm. both Tony and I still have ours in front of us. Yeah. Might it be worth <laughs> and your floaters? <laughs> uh, no, I'm feeling pretty good. Okay. I have a good yeah. friend. You carry on resolving yours. Okay. Um, this Azrak, though, that I basically, once you've reconned uh, a place once, uh, you, you basically get one freebie and then you've got to start paying Azrak to go to another location. Is it worth it? Do we think that Mr Gaunt knows something? Oh, I think he's a grumpy old man. Sorry. Well, I think he's a grumpy old man. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? Let's just leave it then, because if I have to spend this and I can't put it on the location card, it goes over here in our permanent you yeah. yeah. something yeah. this game uh, pile, so... <laughs> OK, so I'm going to try and resolve this so then. So, it. Lucy... Oh, hang on. Um, no, so I keep it here. So Lucy saw Damien outside school gates at before 8 a.m. Mm. Now he didn't turn up to class, and so she told Gaunt that he was skipping class. <gasps> and then she's like, a should snitch. I not have? And you're like, oh, no. God. So she snitched on him? Yeah. Um, huh. But it does it's tell a responsible me to... thing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't play by your rules. <laughs> hey, mate, you Go to school, kids. <laughs> You are so Jennifer right now. <laughs> <laughs> so I need to take token S. Ooh. Uh, Group token. Woo. Mm. Huzzah. Grazie. OK. Damien was here. So oh, I, okay. do I put it? Yeah, That's I mean. That's a big one, isn't it? That was from the last this one. This was from the last one. Um, this. What are these for? 9449. SM. This. this no, this is the this is the timeline. Eight, oh. 8 a.m. What time was on the news? Uh, it didn't say. Okay, but it said we could call someone to find out the time. Mm. They said we, if we have any information regarding the disappearance of Damien. Well, this this Sorry. is any really information could go to the tele. <laughs> Unless this means. I'm curious if it. Hmm. Well, essentially, we're we're collecting time-based evidence. evidence, aren't yeah. we? Yeah. Mm. So, now that we check. have some things that we could report over a phone... Maybe it's worth it. True. Is, there, is there enough? Maybe not. Well, we haven't got her phone yet, so... There are white hexagons that replace places on the map, um, but these are not white, so I, um... I would say that these are not the ones. Um, hey. What you got going on over there? Spooky thing happened, guys. So... Not a clown. Not a clown. I, I walked up to a door and there was a sort of big shadow thing with a face. And it's terrifying. Did it spoop you? It spooked me. What's spoop. <laughs> spoop. <laughs> Is it spoopy? That's adorable. <laughs> spoop. <laughs> yeah, it, it spooped me. <laughs> um, so 
so I've got to take item 20. OK, here we go. I don't think it's going to be good. There you go. <laughs> oh, OK, so I've got a yellow one, uh, which means that's a personal test. Yes. I believe. Yes. It is read secretly and communicated telepathically by the player who took it, which means you can't read it verbatim from the card. Mm -hmm. I might have done that before. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. <laughs> OK, um, so the shadow has gone away. I go into the staff room and there's a coffee pot there. And there's also a newspaper. It's not Another newspaper. <laughs> how, how it works, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, there's more stuff there. <laughs> you need to take them out and read it all and okay. then discard the card. Okay, hang on. We could be now we could be a little flexible. I've got, okay. I've got to read an interaction card, so. Ooh. How you doing out there, Lost uh, in Space? I, 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 I'm, I'm watching the, the expression silence. here. That looks terrifying. This is really creepy. Okay, so there's a newspaper. Mm. Except it doesn't have Damien's face on it. It's got my face. This As if I'm the missing child. Oh, creepy. That is creepy, actually. Ah! No, no! OK. Oh, OK. So, is there anything else to it other than Let's your see face? See if this has changed and then... The that's that's it. Yeah. That's, this is, oh, hang on, no, wait. And then it, then it disappears, the image of my face. And it goes back to Damien or it goes back to nothing? It doesn't say. OK, fair enough. Ooh. OK. Uh, okay, a little bit wigged okay, out now. A little bit wigged. Yeah, that's that's kind of creepy. Does anyone want to? Oh, you're still resolving yours? No, 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 no. I've done mine. I'm just checking to see if these numbers are any re relevant. Okay, where's C? Oh, you've got it. Do we want to go to any of these places again? Oh, did you want me to try and break into? <laughs> oh, locker. Yeah, I would. I did think that was probably worth it. Okay. Um, so we do have to pay an Azrak to explore, yeah. um, which we can't put on here, which means it goes into the mission return pile, um, and we, that's bad. No. Oh, no? No, no, no. Um, you have to spend one of your Azarak into the void mm -hmm. to visit another location uh, yes. on the panorama. Oh! Uh, which means we don't lose it permanently. Awesome. Uh, then you can do the card, mm. spend more Azarak in order to try and get into that one. Oh, I made a mistake. Oh, in that case, I'm going to go on here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go and try and have a chat with Mr. Gaunt. Uh, do you want the, are you paying an Azrak to go to this one? Yeah, I, I think I should him? do it. You okay. break him. I'm not sure it's worth talking to him, he's creepy old man. Except <laughs> 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 um, No, I've got this, so I can take token C. Uh, where? Uh, Oh, if you wish... Oh, mm, I shouldn't say this out loud. And if you have to consume two guys, I don't have to consume... We know, we know what this one is, so we can probably just talk about it, that it's a lockpicking test. Yeah. Yep. Uh, I've got to try and get three for this. OK. Um, You've already got four. Automatically, I already have four. I think you're in a good chance. We've already had a minus two, we've had a zero, we've had a plus one. Yeah. Do you guys think I should... Uh, I need any backup for this, or should I just dive in? Do it. You're on four. Difficulty was what? Three. Ooh. Maybe just one. Yeah, you have a, a lot. I've got a lot. It's fine. Yeah, back me up. And there we, we need to reset after this anyway. That's true, yes. Yeah, because uh, yeah, Chris or Jennifer mean. has not got any left, so... OK. Cool, so I'm going to pull my Destiny card. <laughs> Plus two! Boom. Yay! OK. So now you get the... There you go. So the... Uh, I... Take item 13. 13. There we are for you. Nice. Because you've seen this card, I'm going to show you it. Mm -hmm. Does this mean nothing good comes out of this? Yeah, correct. Oh, you're right. It wasn't worth it. Oh, no. Hang on. Oh, so... No, you, if you get it right, nothing bad happens. No, I still get locked out, though. I still get locked. Oh, yeah, you would do. Oh! Oh! oh. Well, <laughs> oh, you I should have read this book. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's he grumpy. Sure. So, you, uh, are, you, are you. Yay, I resolved it. <laughs> Did you, um, I, I'm so confused. What's going on? You don't lose any extra time, but you are 
Yeah. Oh, so oh, no. basically, whatever happens, uh, Mr. Gaunt is PO'd that you missed the beginning of his lesson and you're locked in. <laughs> it's really so harsh. what what, do, what happens to you now? I think I'm just locked in his lesson until we oh. leave until we until leave this we leave location. This area. Yeah. So, I so find you it... can't support. No, you can support if you're locked, but it's. Maybe. You can't see no. support. You can't discard the panorama at that point. Uh oh. So I find it quite interesting that uh, the two two nerds of the group have been locked in, but no. the cool kids. Yeah, we still got it. Uh, I did flip but over. There is something wrong with going into class. <laughs> <laughs> Stay in uh, class. <laughs> Um, so I did flip over this pan uh, this destiny card, and it says after resolving this test, shuffle all discarded destiny cards back into oh, the pile. Oh. We only had one left anyway, so that's good. Well, but it does mean that <coughs> minus two is back, back, back in there, and we don't know what that last one is. So. Hey, plus two, we have plus two yet, have we? But we oh, no, we didn't. We didn't. So it was a plus two. I can count cards. Nice. When there are seven. <laughs> 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 all right. Okay. Um, I searched Damien's locker. Mm -hmm. Okay. There's nothing in there, pretty no. much, apart from like a tiny scrap of paper. And on it, it said City Council, November the 27th, Anton alone. Did I, you? Yeah, no, when I went and uh, spoke to. Oh, wait, hang on, I know something about this. <laughs> Is it Am I allowed to say? Yeah. <laughs> these, <laughs> these ex. Uh, sorry, lightning bolt cards. That's, are that's our own personal. personal information. Yeah, nothing. Don't worry, as you were. Huh. She's keeping a secret. <laughs> Fine. Well, no one knows anything. <laughs> Watch Anton carefully. <laughs> Write it in the Twitch notes. Come on, get in there. All right, are we doing anything else here? I don't really oh, know. I, I don't know. Is it worth... I'm not... I mean, I'm not... I've spoken to you. You're, you're no good. That was the staff room. Yeah. You've already been in the staff room. I've been in there. I saw a creepy newspaper which had my face for a little bit and then it didn't. Good. Yeah. Good. Um, <laughs> gone through the locker. I don't want to say it, but school was an absolute bust. Yeah. Yeah. But not I, I worth it. Like not, I think you meant to but, learn something. No, but it seems too easy to leave now. As in, uh, we've not gained much aside from knowing that he was outside school at 8 a.m. I doubt that. That's, That's all we know. Yeah. But, well, it it seems that's not enough information. I'm perhaps but speaking we do a bit have too meta here. But three like, other locations to explore. Yeah. True. And I do love it when games really throw you off like that. Yeah. Because you seem you. I'm really bad for that. Even with video games, I go, yeah, I I can see there's a fake wall there or something like that, and you go, yeah, that's the pattern you've gone for. But if a game can sort of go, <laughs> what the? <laughs> then I'm like, you walk into the wall. Uh. As the time captain, I i mean, I don't actually get to choose when we're done, but I do, I think we're done. <laughs> Take the hint. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I do have the gift of the gab as Anton, so... Um, yeah. All right, let's go. Yeah! Okay, cool, cool, cool. School's out. Abby is the murderer, it's been called. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not a murderer. <laughs> and she shakes her knees. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> right, uh, so... I've got red on you. <laughs> You've got Damien's blood on you. Oh, having a Lady Macbeth moment. <laughs> um, so I think we need to get some Azrak back. I'm down to yeah. one. Yeah, I, I'm uh, sorry. Flirting so now, if we do our standard, um, oh, what's it called? Standard. Oh, standard what is it standard called? Standard update. update. Standard, yeah, standard update. update. Which is where we get our Azrak back. Mm. So we only go up to. Yeah, we do have to spend one to do this. So spend one to the permanent mission return pile. Mm -hmm. yeah, no, it's best to sort of distribute these as evenly as possible. So yes. I reckon you two sort of stock back up. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. How many can uh, you take? Four maximum. So take four for now, I reckon. Yeah, so if we're saying four for you. You take three. <laughs> Favoritism. You take two. Then you don't think you need one? It's it's more that you, you need, about you need to, to spend one as well to get us to the next location. Yes, That's a good point. So maybe you we should. Yep. Yoink. <laughs> you, so you you you're both on four. four I'm on four. You're I'm on, on three. three. But then actually no, Tony. Yeah, because you're yeah. going to be the you're next be the time next captain. captain. Okay. And you're the first one I'm now going to be the last yeah person. Yeah. So that, that makes sense. That makes sense. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Okay. All right. So. Time, Captain. Where are we going? Well, Ooh. maybe we Actually, should yeah. give it to. As you're with me, 
So Mummy Games Master is already saying General Store. Yes, Cup Police Station gives us a few more and we'll take the majority vote. Yep, your options are Police Station, Serendipity's Diner or General Store. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And also have a think, everyone else, about our table topics later mm -hmm. as we're going to be talking about... Tony, what are we talking about again? What is your favourite type of game to play? Yeah, whether that's... Cooperative or yeah. competitive, is that what we're going for? Yeah, or, or like giving it general. Euro or party or work placement or... Is there a particular yeah. theme of game you like? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, I think we were talking about it last time, actually, that if a game's designed from something like a movie or a video, because mm. we played um, Fallout Shelter or we Fallout Shelter, the board game, I think it was. It, yeah. yeah. Um, which obviously comes from a video game route. And I, I, I personally always like it when there's... A theme, and it's only if you know it, know about it anyway. Um, if you know a bit about that world it's come from, or yeah. even sort of stemmed from, even if it's not a direct sort of. Uh, I uh, have a vote for the diner because the living Ted is hungry. And so I think that's, that's a legitimate, solid reason. legitimate reason, and I think we should go there. Yeah. However, oh, that's now two for general, two for general store and store. two for the police. Two for the police. You are the time captain. You get the final decision. Mummy Games might have said General Store on our last when you were the time captain, mm. and she was straight in there. So I think we go General Store. Pay your ass rack, let's go. Yeah. There you go, Mummy Games Meister. I got you. <laughs> there we go. Oh, ha, ha. Okay, so I read out the top card, don't I? Mm -hmm. And I lay out these. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, she is grumpy. He's evil. Oh no, she's he, she did it. <laughs> oh, He's judgy as well. <laughs> Is it judge, jury, and execution? Yeah. Okay, so the general store doorbells rings. On the left, the candy section catches your eye. Mm. Yeah, it does. You see a man walking around. In an aisle, boop, an old woman dropped her groceries on the floor. Oh no. Oh. On uh, D. Here. The bully. Be happy about Sorry, that. Sorry, I mean, <laughs> yeah, it's because I was gonna take it from her anyway. <laughs> You make such a good bully. <laughs> uh, the manager's office is closed. A do not disturb sign is hung on the doorknob. Here you go. <laughs> the prescription go drug section is not self-service. Everything is locked. An employee is sorting them out. Prescription drugs. What's the thing? What's the thing we have? Okay. Uh, a cashier is very busy attending to customers. Meh. Nah. There's no one there. This one. Oh yeah, it's not bad. Cool. What are we thinking? I don't like the shop because of Daddy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Daddy's blackmailing everyone or something along those lines. Remember. So uh, Do you have to go to one. I mean, we might as well use you. Yeah. might as well yeah. investigate because um, investigate is for Let's free. keep you away from F. And maybe away from the manager as well. Yeah. If a, I reckon you go B then. Just go for the sweets. You could help the old lady. Help the old lady. Ah, oh, nice, yeah. yeah. Gain some redeeming points. Yeah. Yeah. Let's, let's, um, let's Twitch, to nice. folks at home, where should we go? So you should definitely go to the prescriptions, I think. Yeah, I'm, I probably should head to that. You, you have some information. Okay, okay. we're annoying the cashier. Off. <laughs> oh, everyone in chat's doing such a good job. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go knock on the old manager's office. Okay. I know it says do not disturb, but <laughs> oh no, <laughs> something bad happened. <laughs> uh, maybe. Uh, I'll find out shortly. <laughs> okay, it's okay. <laughs> okay, so guys at home, the cashier is very busy and does not pay attention to you. If we have token O, take item one. If not, the cashier totally ignores you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> we don't have item. We don't have token O. <laughs> does anyone have token O? No. no. <laughs> well, we're out. Twitch. <laughs> Um, How's the, your week been? The same thing happened to me. There was yeah. a newspaper under the door and I looked at it and it had my face on it instead of the Damien's. Maybe this we are really Damien. Creepy. Are we dead? Are we Damien? Maybe we're all the target. Do we see dead people? Wait, what? what? Uh, all the target. Kinda. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> kinda. Oh. Um, well, the, the, the little old lady did the scary ghosty thing. Uh -huh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. 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 Um, oh, and you uh, don't like monsters. I'm not a fan of monsters anyway, no. uh, but she turned back fairly fairly quickly. Okay. Good, good, good. Um, but it is going to require all of my strength in order to help pick up all of her stuff. Did she turn to you and go... Okay. Uh, what I'm, is this I'm lady buying? Uh, uh, bowling balls. <laughs> <laughs> Take one dollar. One dollar he do for you. And token zero. Token zero! Token zero! Ca the cashier! Oh! 
She takes token zero. It's oh. a form of currency. Inter <laughs> That's either $5 or token zero. <laughs> that makes perfect sense. I'm holding a bag of groceries. Oh, um, okay. <laughs> you just awesome. lifted, a, lifted a bowling ball out of a bag or something. <laughs> So, so if you now, you. if you're finished, if you, oh no, you've still got it with you. Uh, okay. I've, still, I've still got a bag of groceries. Do we want to pay I think off? You, I think you should go to the Okay, cashier. so I have yeah. to go you to a to second. Oh, yep, turn sorry. this one. And yeah, to go to a second one, you have to The second pay. one, so paying an extra one. Mm. And... Do we go to the candy guy? If you have token no. go to the candy zero, oh, go take to the candy item guy. one. Oh, my life. There's so many cards changing hands right now. <laughs> and... Do, 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 do. Oh my god. Have you died. No, I just. Take item 16. You need to port in something. Oh! Maybe. <laughs> okay. Uh, I, I don't know if uh, anyone saw, but I just assisted uh, Chris over there with his thing. Because Doug is helping now. Oh, Doug's okay. Doug, Doug's useful. Yeah. I. Um... Is it because I was prom queen twice? You know, maybe, maybe it's about more than that. Okay. You know? <laughs> It's Maybe love. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'm just a really helpful guy, and you guys need to remember that. Um, so basically, Anton's headed over to look at the man by the candy and has got a little distracted by the candy. <laughs> uh, Do you need help being forced away? No, I've got I put, I've got to take a test, and I can it's either I can either try and steal some chewing gum, or oh, I can try and pick the customer's pockets. Um, wow, you are dark. Yeah, do you know what? There looks like there's a wallet in there and I want the wallet. Because if I have the wallet, I can buy more chewing gum. You're already rich. Hey. You are the governor's son. I want daddy to, <laughs> to pay attention to me. Hey, you should totally do it. Yeah, It'll make you really cool. Yeah? Yeah. Will you like me then? Kinda. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Let's go steal something. <laughs> um, so I paid one for the test. I'm, oh wait, hang on, hang on. I do only have a dexterity of one, and I'm gonna need a, a lot of let's, backup. Let's put this back, and I'll just do it, because I've got three. Oh. And I got a baseball bat, so I can just knock his knees out. Good news is, <laughs> with all of that crazy stuff that was going on just a second ago, yeah. Uh, th this lady actually quite likes me because I was oh, very useful. Um, and She's looking for token now, I've got a copy of Damien's ah. receipt ah. from the day that you went missing. Cheeky. Which was at 8.17 in the morning. 8.17? 8.17. So that was after school? It was before, because it was 9 o'clock he was there. It was before. 8.17, <laughs> school, and then this was the afternoon. Was no, I don't think the numbers correspond to no. time, but I'm, I'm interested. Because they can't, because mm. if 9 goes to that, if, if 9 goes to 9, 4 can't go to 4. No. So I don't actually well, know whether they... I don't know what they relate to. No. Mm -hmm. We'll find out, we'll find out. Okay. Right, anyway, uh, shall I go and pick his pocket? Do you want some help with that? Ah, that'd be all right. Cool. Okay, cool. She's got a baseball bat. It's not like I want to Again, help anyway. Again, baseball bat, it's... It's fine, so... I mean, the... By, you, uh, so, so, what, what now? Hmm? The, we've already had the plus two, so maybe you should just take some help with it. Just well, because. maybe I will. So, uh, guys Got at home, many. you are bewitched oh, by an amazing quantity of candies surrounding you. Ooh. So, uh, shall we seal a pack of gum or pick the pocket? <laughs> Listen, I already know what uh, the chat is going to decide. Yeah. <laughs> pick the pocket my or two. Already, yeah, okay. Oh, we're picking <laughs> the pocket. Let's just keep this rolling. So, yeah. uh, so, we need to get a total of three for that. Mm -hmm. We're already at three with our dexterity. So I'm going to throw that into the into the into the vortex. I already paid one to help you. Oh, okay, cool. So I'm we're already at four. Up. Yeah. Nice. Do we get back up again, or add our own one in, or should we just risk it for a biscuit? Risk it for a biscuit. Thinking biscuit. I think in biscuit. Thinking biscuit. Okay, <laughs> let's take, take the biscuit. Oh. Minus one. That's fine. That's we're fine. still at three. Nice. Yeah. We're still at four. Three, four, four, three, 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 three which is e equals. I don't get anything yes, good. Yes, you do. So this is uh, equals and plus. Both have the same resolution. Oh. Oh. So we take item 27. Ooh. The wallet. Okay, Welcome. so... An almost empty wallet. <laughs> <laughs> so worth it. <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> Remove this card and take $2. Oh, well, all right. Cool, cool. At least you got some dollary dues. Dollary dues. Get out. Finally, you've got some money, is that one, right? Yeah. Seems so. Seems Basically. Fine. And we'll put this back, back as well. 
Do we want to go anywhere else in the stall? Sorry. Oops, yeah, sorry. So, all right. So we've we've got everything yeah. else we can from him. Her, her, we've spoken to him, and he wouldn't do anything. Uh, we took got the prescription. Got the prescription. Yeah. Of course, you did. Yeah. Sleeping pills. And I collected those sleeping pills. Wonderful. I think. Sweet it's... dreams. We didn't get anything for that. You found the newspaper under the door. They had my face on it, and we could. If you had a certain thing, you could try and knock. But I think that we that was O, but I'm not certain. So maybe we should come back to it. Or we should, or we should just ignore it. Just no, she, she was. She wanted O. She wanted the bag of groceries. Yeah. So. I can't remember. I'm so sorry. I've let everyone down. Okay, so if I, if I, I'll go. Okay. So I'll spend. That goes in there, does it? Remember. Yeah, it's going there. Yeah. There. And this is why we have to uh, talk telepathically. Oh, no, that, that, that's the one where the little old lady had dropped her shopping. I helped her pick it all oh, up. Oh yeah, and that's take the wrong it through. So that's the wrong one. Oh, sorry. That's that's fair. Scary. Okay, so um, the door is locked, but you can hear the manager. <coughs> excuse me. Door is locked, but you can hear the manager inside. A newspaper is slipped under the door. To look at it, read your interaction seven. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, there wasn't anything on the card. I remember now. However, I'll have in different interactions to yes. you. I it's going to be your face. Maybe your face on a newspaper. You can see your face on a newspaper <gasps> as, if it were, as if you were the missing child before it disappears. I help. What, your face disappeared. Oh yeah, is it the face or the newspaper that disappears? I'm assuming the face. Or the No, I think he pulls the newspaper through. No, just imagine him turned around, there's nothing there. So. <laughs> um Okay. Okay. Well I think we're done in the shop then. Yeah. 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 I'm feeling happy with that. All right. Mm. Moving on. Oh, that was an expensive shop. Look that was that. a very expensive Ooh. shop. And we uh, standardise as <laughs> well. We standard and get yes. our stuff back. I think so. I think it needs to be I two, could do some, yeah. two, two, one. Yeah, then we're all, uh, yeah, you and I are on I've, three. I've got to spend yeah. one now. And the, You've got to spend the one fellas now. are yeah. on yeah. four. And oh, no, wait. Maybe you should take... No, I think I'm. No, you no I'm all right. Yeah, okay. because you're going to have to spend, and then it's yeah. your turn after that. So let's do it. Lovely. Yeah. So options that are left. Uh, we've got Serendipity's Diner. We have the police station. <laughs> yes, Cup says, can we buy gum for two dollars? I mean, <laughs> could have just stolen the gum. We probably would have got more for it. Yeah. Uh, Mummy Games Meister already says off to Serendipity. Mummy yeah. Games Meister yeah. wants to know <laughs> where we're, what, what the deal is. So Serendipity. I'm going with Serendipity. Yeah. Okay. So I'll put that there. For you. Thank you. What's this? Mm. Oh, this is Serendipity. <laughs> That's a really is cool name. Oh, is it Serendipity? Is the, the, the name of the diner? The name of the yeah. diner. Oh, he's grumpy. That's your oh, dad. I her. bet that's your dad. Oh, it looks. It, he's got a sort of um, vote for me badge on, or at least oh. it looks like. Daddy! <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, no, it says, it says Crowley on it. Oh, political, political enemies. <gasps> oh, oh. No, should not go there. Okay. What? Right, okay, so the diner is quite peaceful at this time of the day. Hannah, the waitress, is Andy's sister, one of your classmates. She's cleaning a table. Near the counter, a payphone has been hung on the wall for customer's use. A customer is. Yep. is reading a newspaper. On the right, there's a silent jukebox. Oh, you! I, I, I'm sorry. You're basically the fonts. Can you just go up and go? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I would love to. <laughs> Everything is better with music as well. It's so. true. <laughs> I think oh. you should go and like hit the jukebox. I am just the coolest dude. <laughs> well, okay. What do we think, everyone? Hey. Um, who wants who what? I don't think you should go near. The political rival of your father. Agreed. I think yeah, you point. should take the waitress, though. Yeah. Because no. you. Oh, I'm not, well, I'm not particularly phone. talkative, though. Oh, I'm oh, very that's talkative. True. It's more I was thinking your character and her character is on a similar age. And I was like, maybe you could. Oh, uh, yeah. Possibly. Relate. Again, yeah. But you need to talk on the phone. What's <clears> the thing about the phone? Uh, I have a phone number if I have more information regarding Damien's disappearance. So. I'll go for the phone. I'll go for the phone. Okay. I've got a baseball bat, so <laughs> I'll go and talk to the bloke at the uh, bar. <laughs> and <laughs> hobble the political rival early. Yeah, I'm going for the jukebox. All right, okay. I'm talking to the sister. Ah, she turned into a spoopy ghost. Where is this town. <laughs> Why does she oh. look so horrible? And all the food is mouldy. Gross. 
Can somebody give me item seven? Item seven? And I need 24. Okay, seven we'll do heading now. Minute, Twitch. <laughs> 24. Thank you. Okay, guys, so while you're reading that, try and close yours at the same time. So, guys at home, uh, we've got this businessman who it says Cromley actually on his badge. Uh, and he says, Sorry, kids, but morning coffee is sacred. Could you leave me alone? If you insist on talking to him, read your interaction card three. Shall we do it? Pop it in the chat. Give me a yes or a no. Whatever you choose. I can either take a donut that's old and stale but free because it's on Hannah. Um, <laughs> or I can take a token D because... Uh, Sorry, I'm not supposed to read it out loud. But basically, uh, Damien was in the diner in the morning. I'm just walking casually away anyway, from the one. payphone. <laughs> Three, okay. Um, I kind okay, of want to so take the donut. We, oh, sorry. I don't think I don't think it. I don't think it's useful to take the donut. I think it's Do probably it. more useful to take this item, uh, this... Do it. This yeah. Thing. This is probably... Damien was here, was at the diner. Uh, so Damien was here in the morning of his disappearance. Oh. So around these two, I assume. Okay. Wait a minute, wait a minute, hang on. They're hexagons, so what if... Because four, that's roughly at the same sort of time. Mm. If, again, I think we're really looking too much into this. Let's mm. just stop. Okay. So, um, Where is we... the clock in that hexagon? What time does that say? Quarter oh, to eight. Oh, yeah. You are a smart man. So that is before he was in the shop. Is that yeah, correct? 7 yes. 50, yeah, seven, uh, 8 17 was when 8 he 17. Left, okay. left the shop. Then he went to school. And then he was seen running, running away. the forest. Interesting. Okay, so we spoke to the guy, and you guys at home said you wanted to interact with him. And I'm not sure who's speaking here. I can't decide if it's him, but. No, no, no. Oh, okay, guys, close your ears. Okay. So if you guys remember, at the very start of the game, I read out our secret card about the missing father. Um, Damien is not the only one who's gone missing. Amy's father vanished last Thursday. He's not father of the year, but Amy loves him and will do anything to help him. So this guy at the bar says, Amy, any news from your father? He will come back, don't worry. That's such a pity. He would have loved to meet Simon Twaig, the baseball player. He came here on Thursday morning. Look at that photo. You can see the missing boy, by the way. You can even see the missing boy. By the way, could you do me a favor and pick something for me at the general store? He's a weird bloke. All right, okay, okay. So we take one dollar. We are in the money. Uh, item 10 and token D. I'm very confused as to who's talking though. Is he just randomly giving me some stuff? Oh, sorry, yeah, we you can release your ears. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> uh, could you pass me item 10 and token D? Wait, oh, no, I item already 10 token already D. has gone. And token D has gone as well. A waste of my time. No, no, item 10 was the prescription. Oh. Oh, it's his prescription. Oh. So I've got his oh. sleeping pills. So. You go and speak to him and be like, I think I've got some of yours. What's it going to. Hang on. Is item 10 still... the sleeping pills? It, no, item 10 was the prescription. For the so you could have handed him back his prescription, or we've done a runner with his meds. <laughs> but you could just give him his meds. I could give him the meds, which ultimately is probably what he wants. So Possibly. What does it say on the card? 10 strange. or 17. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I've seen uh, James Barnes of Darby's comment there. Uh, what, well, <laughs> um, is, did it say 10 or 17? Sorry, it was on the card. Oh no, it was on here. On there. Item 10 and token D. So token D was the... the, the timestamp. The timestamp. Okay, yeah, sure. Oh. And 10 was, I say you go and talk to him. You've got his drugs. Yeah? He's drinking too much coffee. Okay, I can I will, I will say, yeah. the uh, telephone couldn't phone through to anyone. Interesting. Mm. Um, there was the option of breaking it open and taking more money. Oh, okay. I'm not sure it was particularly worth the penalty if it all went wrong. I mean, I've okay, got a baseball okay. bat. So, uh, Okay. Just, just to fill you guys. That's my go-to thing. On. <laughs> uh, Got one thing. <laughs> uh, what happened with me? I went to go and uh, to that silent jukebox. Mm. As I got close to it, everything just went really, really squiggly, and suddenly there was no sound. I was deaf for a minute, and then I got my hearing back, and uh, I've got a sort of personal, personal test, 
which is saying that if I want to play a song on it, I'd have to pay a dollar and then I could choose a particular song. Oh, the, the waitress said um, don't play number 23 because it reminds her of the missing kid. Play number 23! Okay, okay, cool. Oh, horrible. Game. I don't have any money. I got money. I got gallons of money. <laughs> oh, After <that's>... you! <laughs> you just pay some money. So Not that that's a way of counting money. I have a gallon of money. You have to spend an ASRAC into the void, I think, in you order to... will do in order to be able to pass, investigate again. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, or me. to pass... I thought, I thought you could pass items if you spend money into the void. No, but I'm actually in a support phase, so I can do it. I can just pass over. Really? I thought we could, thought we could exchange sure items for Whoop. free in the between. Just quickly double check. So that you, you can do that, but I think you can also you can also pay in order to exchange during support phases as well. Mm. I'm fairly sure. Oh yeah, sorry. So I need to pay an Azrak. Uh, give one or more of items or tokens to other agents. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I would have to pay to give you that. Do you want to do it? I think it's worth it. Yeah. Uh, into the void. Okay, I, I need to pay as well. Mm. Um, so that uh, I can play. Got a couple. Have, have, have two. Oh, oh <laughs> thank you. So Drink generous. Yourself. So get, generous. Get some chewing gum. <laughs> so I'm going to just pay some money. Money. And uh, we're going to play song 23. Uh, so where we are here, yes? <laughs> yes, <laughs> item 23. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Never oh, again. well, you want yeah, item 23, sorry. Oh, yes. <laughs> I've seen this one before. Thing. I wonder what song Amazing. it is that reminds her. Bearing in mind it's 1958. What song would it remind Return her? Return to Sender. No? <laughs> Anyone? Elvis? No? Okay. Cool. <laughs> um, okay. Right, so um, the atmosphere is just getting really, really close. Um, I'm feeling this, just a sudden urge. I need to go and find Damien. I'm getting the sense. I know. Okay. <laughs> I'm getting the okay, sense. Hun. Um and uh, I feel Christmas. No, wrong one. I'm really bad at this. And then I take a uh Asrak from the vor vortex. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Okay. Maybe you all should right. read this verbatim, Tony. <laughs> I probably should. I'm not very good at this. I get all the points. <laughs> <laughs> I win. <laughs> okay, and then that's it for me. All right. All right, cool. Um I think we're done here. No, I was going to talk to the guy because yes. I've got yes. his sleeping pills. Okay, we only have five minutes left, so we're going to speed ah. through that and then we'll go to the police station real quick. Okay. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. So you uh, into the void, you do that. Yeah. Okay. So he's a bit grumpy. He doesn't really want to talk to me, uh, but I insist like, hey, talking hey, to him. Hey, I've got like, your, your come on. here. I took all this trouble to come and see you. Oop. Can I read this out? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, why not? Um, so I think this is clearly him talking. Uh, you're the stubborn kind, aren't you? I don't know any Damien, but have you seen this photo? It's me with Simon Twaig, the famous player of the Boston baseball team. He's a nice guy, by the way, but who's that kid over there? I mean, we're children, that kid Take there? token D. I've already got it. Got it. No! Oh! <laughs> but that's the one that told us that Damien was here. So wait, hang on, is Damien still said so there was two out? accesses to this. The the waitress yeah. Yeah. told us that the picture was taken and that was the last photo that could be of Damien. And the other one is him showing off and going, oh, yeah, missing kids in it. Yeah. Oh, I see. Yeah, he's saying, yeah, that yeah, he, Damien is in there, in the photo. Oh. Damien's in this photo with the back. Oh, the no, no, there. I get it. Right, look, the photo's at the back there. Yeah. I was wondering what photo they're on about, and it's that, that's, that's the baseball player. Mm. He has been there a long time drinking his coffee. And then <laughs> it's got to be cold. And Damien's there as well. So did you play the song on the carry on the jukebox? Yeah, I did. Yeah. Now, oh, it's a shame. Which got me a vortex. Oh, sorry, an asrac. Did it say anything about her? Because now that's playing. No. Interesting. What, Shall I go and talk to her again? Her, it, no, I think it, just it made her, it reminded her, her of him. Mm. It's driven you to find him. So it gave yeah. you a cue back. So that was more of a hint as to grab okay. something back. Yeah. So. To the next place. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Police station. I think that's it, isn't it? Hello to Sil Sylvan O.L. Dudo. 
who says, hello, Abby, it was nice chatting with you about Damien on the Space Cowboys booth at Cannes. Woo! Hello. Have you got hints? I no. <laughs> uh, no, I was just uh, having a chat about, I was watching someone play this. Um, yeah, trying to get hints, didn't get any hints. Um, but yeah, oh, hello, thank you for joining us in the stream. So. I say we leave them there. We'd we lose yeah. one anyway. Yeah, that's not yeah. worth it. Right, so last one, police station. Go. That, that's me. That's, that's you. Yeah, you're right. Pay, so, pay the Azrak. Police station. Okay. Oh, hang on, what's that oh, one? Oh, this looks a wonderful place to be. Oh, that's serendipity, sure. Ah, yeah, come on. Serendipity done. Right. This is for you. Ooh. Damien's in the police station. What's the betting? <laughs> I wonder if your dad's in here. These I read out loud completely. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, if you do not have token A, take item 31. Uh-oh, because that's the only token that we don't have. Before reading card A of this location, so... Oh, okay. The policeman at the reception desk does not take you seriously and speaks in a firm tone. No, no children allowed in here. By the way, shouldn't you be at school? You must convince him to let you in. <clears throat> If you would like to negotiate, the time captain chooses an agent to initiate this test. Ooh. If an agent, <laughs> there we go. If an agent <laughs> removes item 14 or item 18 before the destiny card is revealed, the agent who attempts the test gets a plus two bonus to their result. So have we at any point had 14 or 18? Uh, I don't think don't so. Don't believe so. No. no. What have we not done? We went through the... So many cards. I know we put some <laughs> back on the bottom, but only a couple. Um, oh, I've... No, nothing... 14. Interesting. Well... Oh, hang on, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, no, 14 or 18, I thought you had it. Mm. I am very chatty. You are very, very chatty. I do have a baseball bat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, dokie. Um... Yeah, I, th I think we need to talk our way in here. Yeah. So you are the best person to do that. Absolutely. Okay, so I'm going to... Do you want some support? I would love some. So I'm going to spend an Azrak to I'm get myself in. Support there as well. So that makes me on four. I'm going to spell. I'm going to support myself for five. Five. Shall I go? Yeah. If you want... The test result is a six. seven. The test result is a seven. So we need a plus one. Mm. I think... Should we leave? We've, all, we've all very low on Azrak yeah. right now. Yeah. yeah. Right, let's hope there's pray. Everyone pray for us. R drum roll, please. That's right! Okay, take token A. Token A. I just Do want to point out. Do these pop back in? Like, uh, so I know they say yeah. pop out. Um, uh, yeah. I think all you guys need to be reminded that Doug was really helpful during well, that then, moment. Doug. Yeah. It's just a picture it's just, of it's just a dude, with it? a donut. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Right. That is. is that all you got no, from that? Uh, we, we made it through and we have token A, yes. so we can continue reading this card. Mm -hmm. uh, you enter the police station. The policemen are, policemen are busy. Some screams from a cell drown out their conversation. The detective offices are in the back. On the left, two office doors are closed. Policemen seem to be busy over a table. Further away, you see an office door ajar, and you can find cells at the far right of the station. I would like to go to the cells. Is someone in there? Yeah. yeah. I think it might be your dad. You don't know my dad's missing, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is a sensitive subject. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've heard that your dad spends a lot of time in jail, though. Wow. Whoa! <laughs> Burn! Sorry. Oh! <laughs> Didn't you say that? Oh, oh, that no, like... Abby. Oh, you were the I bully. Did. Yeah! <laughs> Put me out of a job. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, well, your dad's a bad politician. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Truth hurts, okay? Yeah. <laughs> well, seeing as my dad is a politician, shall I try and just walk into the this o o Do office? you know who I am? Don't do, you know? Do that, yeah, you'll be fine. Do you know who I am? Papa, can you hear me? <laughs> where, where are you heading? I don't know. Because I... Two office doors that are closed and there's... Yeah. ...policemen around a table. I should probably go <sighs> to the one that has fewer people to potentially talk to. I'm not that good at top skiing either. <gasps> but I can punch policemen in the face. Um, so <laughs> maybe not an idea. Um, I'm going to spend my last Azrak to do this thing. OK. Do you have a preference to it? I have neither preference. OK, Grab I'll take the nearest one. I'll take the nearest one. 
So, ladies and gentlemen, um, don't bother covering your ears, it's fine. As soon as you approach the cells, an inmate runs towards you. He looks very upset. I haven't done anything, I swear. It was him, the ghost. I saw him vanish right in front of me. Tell my daughter Amy, that's us, I haven't done anything. If you embody Amy, take token F and place it on your snap recall card. Can I have token F, please? You this recognize your father. Yay! If not, return this card to the panorama. I recognize my father. Can I have item two? No. Item two? Yes. That was an excited look. Yes. <laughs> what do we know? OK, so um, I walked into the room and I found a female detective there. And turns out she is in charge of finding Damien. It's her case. Um, at first, she was kind of like, oh, Doug, clearly you've been picked up by the police and brought in again. <laughs> and I was going, no, I'm here. I'm here to help. And she's like, oh, so you've got information. So I'm just going to see what I can offer her right now. Mine was an Very... absolute dud. Uh, the room was empty. I could pay an Azraq to search it. Found a newspaper. I saw my face again. I'm now out of Azraq, so I've been booted out of the location. <laughs> was uh, not worth it. <laughs> if we find... It's, so when it said, if you, if you embody Amy, which we do, guys at home, uh, take token F and place it on your snap recall card. Of course, our snap recall card is this lightning bolt one we have here. Mm. Which means I also we, we also get uh, I mean it depends because it says find Amy's father. This is my objective. Free and safe and sound. I mean he's not free. He is safe. He is safe. Yeah. He's not free. He's not free. So I don't know whether this counts, but I kind of think it does. Um, anyway, telepathy time. Mm. Chat to the policeman at the state at the table. <laughs> You may have reason to believe that he may get, that they need to get go, but it needs to be you that talks <laughs> to them. There you go. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna put that voice. back. <laughs> so we're saying I've not got the because we we get two tokens back if we if he's free and safe and sound. You need to get him out. You need so, to get him out. Yeah? yeah. Okay, so I'll go and spend a token to talk to this bloke here. Uh, this one, yeah, it was C. Uh, yes, yes. Oh my god, okay. So he's a zombie and he climbs he over. You just entered the office that Detective Yozor turned at what? You just entered the office that Detective Yozor turns into a terrifying zombie about to jump on you. Huh. I got him. Oh. Everything goes back to normal. It's fine, don't worry about is it. He's busy and seems to be writing a report. He hastily sends you away. Get out. I've got to take care of the guy we just busted. If, as if I didn't have too much work already with this damn accident on the main street. This guy had to wreck the bar from next town. If you are Amy and you do have tokens F and K, hello, mm -hmm. take okay. item 33. Ooh. Item 33. It's going to be Daddy. There we go. Take item Daddy. What? You're <laughs> sure he was seen on that morning? If this is true, you're right. Fox couldn't be in two places at the same time. Damn it! I have to start all over. The policeman takes the key out of the cell, then opens it. A tired-looking man gets out. Dad! Amy throws herself in his arms while the man bursts into tears. Amy! I, I saw so many hot... He hugs his daughter tightly. It literally says horror and dot dot dot. I so really now we like, get the two things back. I really like that the detective was like, this kid says that their dad was not at the bar, so I guess that's fine. <laughs> you know, it wasn't sir. for you meddling kids. <laughs> I have some exciting news, guys. Ooh. So, uh. Are they mean yet? Oh. Not yet. Okay, Jeez. But maybe we're close. Or a bit closer than we were 30 seconds ago. <laughs> so, um, the female detective, she's walked out of the room, and behind her, there's a board which has red string all over it, which is tracing. Uh, Damien's route. Mm. So maybe this can help us figure out where he was at certain times. Got it. So I've got to take items 29 and 30. Okay. And yes, yes, Cup, we did do it, technically. We've won. Now, <laughs> you just sit back and let them finish it. Oh, okay. Anyway. Amazing. I think we can probably all look at these. Okay. It's uh, a little bit complicated. So we have a little board for our hexagons. Yay! Uh, and there's the numbers. And that gives us the order um, so we've got where Damien went. So got four Oh. Hang on, these are all... Oh, no, they're not. No, they're not. Okay, so... Mm -mm. Hmm, interesting. Oh, wait, no. If we put them back in the order that we had them, then it's telling us to... I think. Oh, no, wait, no. For... No, sorry, you're right. Four. Interesting. So... He was... At the diner. He was yeah. definitely at the diner first. 
Then he was at the Grocery groceries. Store. Then he was at school. Yeah. And then he, and was, then he was seen causing an accident. Running across the road into the forest. So I believe that is the... So, assemble both parts of the board. Did you read this out? No, I didn't. At any time, you can put the four hex hexagonal tokens of the locations Damien went to in chronological order. Mm. Try to remember the time. Mm. Figure out the biggest number you can see. Then the time captain takes a corresponding items and so resolves it. The biggest number that we can see is nine. Yeah. There's also a number on the actual card itself, so... so oh, yeah. 47, 56... Oh, 84, like this! 94, 94 here we are. 92, 94. 94. Oh, my gosh. I feel like we're close. Oh. You're the time captain. Oh. Please, Chris. Oh. Ah. Ah. Everything darkens around you. Detective Ansel turns into a horrible creature. Good. Um, good. good. Mm. We're in a fight. And Jennifer gets a minus one penalty during the test. Oh, no! <laughs> I'm, I'm completely okay, well, got out to, of the location. I've got, I've got to take part. Yeah. I'm only on strength two this time around. Um, I, I can support you though, which is good. I have no. Okay, so that takes me to three. This is a difficulty four. Test. Just watching. And okay, please, guys. I'll give you one. It's my only one. No, 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 no. I, I can only support one, can't I? We're going to um, have to. See, my, my, my point being is I can't give two. So, I'll, um, are you? Have you already put one in to I've do it? I put one in to do the time. Okay, so I'll support test. it. Let's just keep this separate for now, just so we know what okay. we're up to. So, so one starts. Okay. That puts me to strength three. And then I think I should have. Chuck mine in, right? Okay, and then we've got to pray this destiny card is something. Are you good. in the void with me? Sorry? Are you in the time void with me? Are I don't have any. Yeah. All right, yeah. ready? Yeah. That's good. Oh, fun. Hey! Excellent. Doug, help with that. Oh, the positive result is we get locked. Uh, so we're stuck. <laughs> I'm stuck at this location. <laughs> no! So were we wrong? Uh, no, 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 we were right. We. Uh, well, no, no, we must have been wrong. We must have been wrong. Must have been wrong. Oh, uh, no. She, she got fighty. <gasps> You got fighty. We were wrong. Hang on. What does the clock go? Might need to do some detective work, guys. <laughs> quarter to eight. It is quarter to eight. Oh no, it's quarter to nine. As in it time. Oh yeah, no, I meant on the, the little clock. <laughs> oh yeah, we really are running out of time. Yeah, as we well. really are. <laughs> that, that was me so slow time, you think. Yes, Abby, moving along. Uh, so this was this was quarter to eight that he was in here. So what did that bottom section say on the lower card? Assemble both parts of the board uh, da, 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 on this one. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Figure out the biggest number you can see, then the time captain takes the corresponding item and resolves it. Perhaps he caused the accident before he decided to bunk off school. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Four, nine, two, six. But didn't when he get hit when he got hit by the car? Didn't he then run off into the forest? He did run off into the forest, and I figured that that would make sense. That right? was just. Hang on. None of us have been to a, the forest. Forest no, is not really a forest. Yet. Yeah. yeah. That would be my first place to look. <laughs> <laughs> He's just under a tree reading a book. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> um, interesting. What have we done wrong? If you'd like to find out the answer for this, Chris, <laughs> you can go to your sort of local game store and hopefully they've got the demo and you yeah. can play it through. We are literally going to have um, to leave it there because we have yeah. to move on to table topics. Um, I am so sorry, everyone, that we failed you. <laughs> I don't know because... I think we've gone wrong with the timings. That's the only thing we, we've got. This one was it's just it was before 8am. Yeah, that's definitely quarter to eight. What time was his receipt? Does it say on? Oh, of course, it's tiny. Right? Uh, eight seventeen. And what time oh no, 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 no! So that's there then, because that was before eight a.m. She said, if that's eight seventeen, oh. that brings us there. I she was before nine o'clock. No, no, no! It was eight a.m. Oh. Which brings the total to still ninety four. Still ninety four. That can't be right. No, no, 96. 96. Oh. Tune go, in. Chris, go. go. <laughs> quickly, 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 quickly. 96. Oh, there we go. That looks like a good card to me. Oh. Okay, so, very impressive. Thanks for coming to the police station with these information. Those information. You drew the same conclusions as me. All right. Yeah. Now we must figure out where Damien went after all this. Do you have any idea? 
The forest. Choose only one destination. Forest, forest, so hang on, hang on, forest. hang on. So we've got to the hills, take item 34. To the sea, take item 35. To the mountains, take item 36. To the forest, take item 37. To the lake, item 34. Uh, 38, sorry. Forest. We're going forest. Yes, let's do forest. it. Forest, boom. Woo! <laughs> forest, forest, forest. Oh. He's dead. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Time seems to stop. <coughs> then everything speeds up. <coughs> Uh, you feel like you have been swallowed. A whistling hurts your ears while gusts of wind blow over your heads. <clears throat> <clears throat> um, the scream tears time apart. You feel a compelling force pushing you towards an old mansion. That can't be good! <laughs> Why is it a mansion? <laughs> <laughs> Choose the location you are visiting and move to location 13 at no cost. The time captain opens location 13, then reads card A aloud. <gasps> 13. We have 13 Ooh, let's minutes. Just quickly grab let's yeah, let's clear this off. Ooh. Do you know what, guys? We're going to run over because I, I, I we're going to run yeah. over because I want to know how this ends. <laughs> we need to solve this. Uh, do, 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 Stay with us. D, C, D, okay. A. This location is to be set up differently from the others. Read card A before exploring this location. Well, hang on. Should we distribute these back out? Because we're all going to need some. Yes. Probably an idea of we'll yeah. one. Left. Spend yeah. one here. Done. One. So you've got I've none. Got none. So it would give three to you've you first. I've got none. Yeah. Oh gosh. Okay. Um, Who's time captain? Is it you, Abby? Me. I'm time but, captain. Uh, but he doesn't need to spend anything. I don't need anything. to spend it to him. Oh, uh, okay. Um, so you take three. Cool. And you take... One, two. I'll, um, I feel you should take it, because I've solved my thing. So maybe I'm going to be less used okay, here, even though I've got really good stats. Uh, read a card A out loud. Okay, so that one goes this there. This <clears throat> Uh, you walk towards the end of a dark path. From the from the huge decaying mansion in front of you comes a strange whisper. Anton. Ooh. It yes. was you. <laughs> Set up the location I help you. as depicted. Right, so there are some strange shapes going on here. All right. Uh, so card A, which is this one here. Mm -hmm. Card B. C, D, E. Ooh. And then... F and G side. Oh, look at that. Wow. Spooky. Is it spoopy? Yeah. How do you not know that spoopy is a word to me <laughs> and Philip? We say it all the time. <laughs> I swear on every stream, we're like spoopy. Uh, beginning with a time captain, <laughs> take turns revealing and reading it out loud each card in this location, starting with card B. <gasps> Ugh, okay. Let's hope I don't have to get punchy. Uh, <laughs> did you? This is a gloomy mansion. It would look abandoned if it were not for the small, faltering light from the attic. A scream breaks the silence. Damien, it's him. Anton collapses, oh. then immediately jumps to his feet, straight oh, as a no. ramrod. Oh, no, she's back. All right, he happened. Oh, someone's possessed. It's going to take, <laughs> take them off. Right. You. Okay. Let's see if Anton can read this well possessed and... <laughs> <laughs> Just up a little bit, up a little bit, up a little bit. <laughs> Damien is talking to you. Anton, save me, but come alone. Do you hear me? Alone. Sounds like a rubbish idea. <laughs> sounds like a terrible idea. Are you really sure about that, Damien? <laughs> Anton is a trance as if possessed. He floats a few millimetres above the ground. He's attracted to the mansion, the oh gosh. <laughs> The agent who embodies him seems to have lost control over him. Oh. Guys, I'm out. I've lost control. Okay. <laughs> Anton disappears into the hedge surrounding the mansion. <laughs> Die! Um, there's, some, uh, there's, some, there's some plants over there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, Amy manages to catch his ankle just in time and to retain him somehow. With your baseball bat. <laughs> <laughs> right. Jennifer and Doug decide to grab her and pull her back with all their might. <laughs> <laughs> the feet of your receptacle slide in the muddy soil. Everyone is driven to the mansion by Anton, who seems to have an incredible strength right now. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take F. <laughs> uh, while trying to hold back the mayor's son, the receptacles pass through a hole in the fence that was hidden by the hedge. You are now in the garden of the mansion, a children's down your spine. On a gravestone, you can read Katharina uh, Cavendish, 1884. That's not my name, no. Uh, after a few moments, you hear Damien's hoarse, worn-out voice. Anton, I said alone. Alone! 
Hello. Well, we had a choice. Yeah. Like, right. Uh, two thunderbolts crack the darkening sky over the mansion. The atmosphere is getting oppressive. The time agency sends you a telepathic message. You found the origin of the temporal anomaly. Now you have to learn about this man. Learn more about this mansion. It is key to everything. You are now on your own. Good luck. To be continued in the full adventure of Time Stories Revolution. Oh! Oh! This mansion. Oh! Oh! Yes! Oh! Guys, amazing. Oh. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Did anyone actually finish their... Aside from us, Twitch. Uh, potentially, finish. actually. Uh, no. Who... I didn't. Who has how much money? I have two dollar. I, I have three, and if I finish with more, we remove one from the... Yay! Hey! So succeeded slightly better than we had before. <gasps> oh, it says perfect. Woo! <laughs> Give me my five. <laughs> <laughs> so messy. Good job, guys. That's really great. <laughs>